Hi friends, it's Mrs. Rogers here. Today I'm going to be reading you the story Far Above Earth, A Day on the Space Station. It's written by Jane Simon. Grab your copy of the book and follow along with me. The first page here is the contents page. You can see all the different parts of the story we will listen to today. Living in Space. A space station is a place that floats far above Earth, and it is an amazing home for astronauts. Here, some lucky astronauts sleep, eat, work, and play on the space station for months. But living in space is very different from living on Earth. Did you know only about six astronauts can live on the space station at one time? Waking up in space. Each morning, this astronaut wakes up in a tiny room. She yawns and tries to stretch. But waking up in space is very different from waking up on Earth. In space, she can sleep standing up or upside down. So she unzips her sleeping bag and just steps out of her tiny room. Did you know there is no up or down on the space station? So bedrooms can be on the walls, floor, or ceiling. Getting around in space. To get to work, this astronaut just goes down the hall. But going down the hall is very different from getting around on Earth. In space, she doesn't walk. She floats. Earth's gravity does not pull her down. So she uses handles on the wall to pull herself along the hall as she floats. Did you know gravity pulls objects toward the center of Earth? There is very little gravity on the space station. Washing in space. This astronaut likes to wash her hair in the morning. She brushes her teeth and washes her hair. But washing in space is very different from washing on Earth. Water pouch, shampoo. In space, astronauts can't turn on a faucet. If they did, the water would just float away. Instead, they squirt water from a pouch. Did you know on the space station, water sticks together in round blobs that float in the air? Eating in space. Sometimes this astronaut eats rice and chicken for lunch. They taste pretty good, but eating in space is very different from eating on Earth. In space, most food comes, from, comes in bags to keep it from floating. A floating apple or pear is not a problem, but floating crumbs can get into small spaces and cause trouble. Did you, knew, did you know astronauts use tortillas instead of bread because tortillas don't have bread crumbs? Exercising in space. All the astronauts exercise every day. This astronaut likes to ride a bike after lunch, but exercising in space is very different from exercising on Earth strapped in. A bag on the space station does not have a seat, so the astronaut rides standing up, and he wears a strap to hold him in place as he pedals. Did you know the body cannot work against Earth's gravity in space? If astronauts don't exercise every day, their muscles will get weak. Free time in space. After dinner, the astronauts have free time to relax. They can play music, write home, or read a favorite book but free time in space is very different from free time on Earth. Sometimes they just want to look out the window. Looking at Earth makes them feel just a little bit closer to home. Only two rooms on the space station have windows. The rest have solid walls. And she's looking at Earth. This last page is the glossary. An astronaut is a person who travels in a spacecraft Exercise, activity a person does to stay strong. Gravity, pulling force in space that also pulls things toward the center of Earth. Muscles, part of the body that cause movement. <laughs>